I have a question for you down that lens and you, Matt, holding the camera. Oh, okay. Hello, Matthew. Hello, hello. Are you faster at going with a fade or a draw? So if I swing in to out and try and get the face close to the path. Compared to swinging out to with a face slightly open to a path, so functional draw, functional fade. I know my draw goes further, but which one do I swing the club head faster at? Do I, is it like forehand, backhand? Am I faster on one side? I don't know. For me, what are you guessing for you? I'm gonna say I'm quicker swing speed with a draw. So this isn't about distance, because we'll talk about that, that's delivery. This is about which one do we swing faster at, out to in, into out. I did this once with Kevin Harper, and he was faster swinging out to in than into out. Oh no. <laughs> Let's get stuck in. Do you have a preferred side, so more into out to out to in for distance in this box up here? If you're new here, consider hitting the subscribe button. If you're already subscribed, ring the bell. Remember to give me a thumbs up if you like this kind of video, and then I'll just know to do more of them. Back to the video. Just so I'm clear, are we hitting as hard as we can with both or finding fairway? So I'm gonna do a bit of a mixture of both. Okay. So I'm gonna go fade draw, try and hit fairway, but kind of hard, then I'm gonna just smash it. Okay. Because at the moment, well, I feel like I can hit fairway with both, but I am more fadey. That's a push fade. That's my fade swing. That's going in the water. Late oh. ball, splash oh. ball. There it goes. Oh no. <laughs> That's my straighter one. <laughs> I'm gonna do another one, same kind of ideas with club path, but trying it fairway this time. So I'm 1.8 out to win club path on that one. Uh, club club speed, speed 109. 109. Better start in the round. So one more fade. Again, that's gonna hit fairway. That's fairway ball. It's like a tiny butter fade at the most. Yeah. It's like made for me this time. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so I was three out to win. Three out to win, 109 again. 109. So I'm now going to try and hit. For all intents and purposes, the same shot, but turning it the other way. Not trying to put any more energy in, just trying to hit it kind of at the speed that feels natural to hit a fairway. But I'm not, I'm not easing off. Does that make any sense? Yeah, so that's where I was confused. I'm like, I'm like 100% where like, I'm going to do the next set of 110% if you like. Okay. I know those percentages aren't correct. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Could have said that was 90% and that one's 100% but I went the other way. Right, so this is going to be now into out club pass but still trying to find that fairway with a nice hit. And this is my harder shot at the moment, but I am, I'm even just waiting shots like, yeah, I've drawn. That's a draw, yeah. That's in the water the other side. Yeah. Don't ever go to this course. Oh no. Life. I was quite happy with that shot. <laughs> so 109. 109 and into out three. three. Very good. So one more draw. Maybe a slight heel strike. No, but that's fine. It's going to go in the same place. It's another so you see, I'm ball. much more fadey at the moment. Yeah. We are on the most brutal ass playable. <laughs> we are on the most brutal, brutal hole on the planet. Three um, into three out. Three into out, 109. Oh, no. So I'm not moving. No, you're the same. So I'm going to do two more shots and I'm going my 110%. I'm going to go out of my boots <laughs> at it. Right, fade, out of my boots. I'm going to 10 finger it. Well, I'm not going to 10 finger it actually. Do you know why? I find it hard to fade it. To, I'm very drawery. Okay. So I'm going to go... You'll go 110% same grip. Yeah. Fade. Oh, that's a great shot. That is a arrow ball. My goodness. <laughs> that always tells me to give it a wallet, doesn't it? <laughs> Look at that, end of the fairway again. That's uh, a 112. One, I've gone fast now. I'm out of the wind 2.7. That's my extra speed. What's that carry? 276. Oof. Definitely quicker, aren't you? I am quicker. You're getting quicker. It's good. Yeah. That's a toe. It's going to work. That is working. That's a so draw ball. It's going to fly as far I'd imagine. I say that. Oh, it's through the fairway. That's my voice against the rock. <laughs> Was that the perfect toe? 112, 3 in, into out. Three. So I'm literally the same person I've all side, aren't I? Yeah. Let's have a look at the distances. 255, 266 fade. Uh, 271, 269 draw. So further with my draw, which we would know. 
Uh, 32, 32 peak height with the jaws, where it's 34 and 40 peak height with the fades. They're higher. Two spinning under 2,000 with the jaws, one at 2,500 with the fades. So the club head speed is identical with mm. them. 109, 108, 108, 108. Um, you're just delivering different numbers, basically, completely different numbers. I'm not as up on one of the shots with my fade. I'm only one, uh, no, that's not, yeah, I'm not as up. 3.2 up, 3.1 up, where I was four up with both of my jaws. Because mm. jaw to me feels like under it and up and out. Yeah. Fade feels almost more level, even though it's not. Um, if I go Brammer ball. Big ball. 279 carry draw. 276 fade. Cool. Again, 39 peak height to 41 with the fade, and then 2400 spin with the fade to 17 with the draw. Cool. I'm just producing better delivery numbers into out. 5.8 up Brammable draw <laughs> yeah. to 4.4. Um, interesting. It's my delivery. My speeds are the same. I can hit a fade as far as I hit a draw if I was to get the deliveries the same. The same, yeah. That yeah. I've got no sidedness apart from my delivery on that test is better when I'm trying to hit the draw for distance maxing. Yeah. Let's see what you do. Right, fade ball to start, coach. Fade ball. You want me to hit this fairway, do you? <laughs> <laughs> <Good one. laughs> so I think my fade's going to be um, slower. In speed. speed? Because I, like you were talking about your deliveries there, I think that mine are totally different, a lot different than what you were doing. Like angles attack, mine's gonna be down with my fade, and I feel like my draw's gonna be a lot more up. But so would that extremes. make you go far? It didn't make me change speed. No, I know, it? but it I feel... It made me change speed or distance, but it didn't make me change the actual physical speed yeah. that head was travelling at. Because I feel like I do different things too. Yeah, go on then. Let's see. What I love about all these tests is what shines through the most is that you're different to me, which yeah. is obvious because we're not the same person, yeah. are we? So this is fade. That's a toe up. Get over those trees. But all I care about is out to in path. I don't care if you get the other angles right. I want to know, yeah. 114. Three out to in. Three out to in. Perfect. Dodgy strike. Yeah, face the path that was 0 0.3 open. Yeah. So it's all strike that buggered you there. Your numbers are for a little straight to fade. Maybe slight pull to fade. Yeah. Keep it out to in, keep it at your regular speed, and there's the compare. Another fade, yeah? Yes, please. Another <laughs> funny strike. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you are. Uh, yeah, I've not seen that part of that water there. That's yeah. out to in again. Yeah, Open. cool. Let's have That's one where you mean. strike one would be nice. <laughs> I have been on a funny stag this weekend. <laughs> 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 that was not a strike, was it? That one. Same numbers though. Like yeah. 14, speed path. Same. Yeah, and path four out to in. In contact. Yeah. Fade a little. There we go. To win. 13, 14, and out to in. So let's draw this ball now. Too much toe again. Oh, you hit the tree and come back in the fairway. <laughs> it's, come. it's so you. Oh, four mile an hour faster. And my numbers are good there. So that two in to out. out. Just strike. You gotta strike it. Yeah. Wow, you are got no backhand, but you've got a forehand. Yeah. This is what's so interesting as well, isn't it? Like, if you came in and had a lesson or I came in, our conversations are completely different again, aren't they? And this is where, for me, YouTube, for me, I see it as a vehicle to become better at what I do. Yeah. Uh, where so many in the way it going at the minute, it's a vehicle just to get as many views on the most ridiculous video you can make. Tests like this make, make them, yeah. better coach. Yeah, yeah. Because if you don't know that people are sided, yeah, 100%, yeah. you're gonna try and get 
you know, you're, whoever, whatever tennis star you can think of was noticeably weak on one side. I mean, Federer runs around his backhand sometimes. Yeah. His backhand's better yeah. now, but like he runs around because his forehand stronger. Yeah. yeah. Like, why well, you want to enhance yeah. weapons you, with people so while at it, the same time fix issues? You put it in tennis scenario, and you're hitting fifty percent of your backhands out, and seventy-five percent of your forehands are going in. Like twenty-five percent, you keep running rapid. Yeah, don't you? totally. Why would you put that percentage in there? Hundred percent. Oh, there, you're four mile an hour fast. That's amazing. And I, the only two point six into out. The only number I'm disappointed with it is the um, end of attack there. Yeah, we'll look um, at the numbers in depth in a second. I want to look at my carry distance. No, <laughs> that last one bounced back 50 <laughs> yards. There's another toe, but it might work. Or oh, too much. Yeah, you 117, want. quicker. Four miles an hour. Isn't right, it? okay, I want you now to go fade for me though, because. Fade beefer. I want you to fade exactly like you've just been hitting those draws. So whatever speed you say, I want to fade it now. Because is it you getting quicker or is it you getting quicker? Me getting quicker, yeah. To fade now, out to win, but that speed. So without trying yeah. to get that speed, classic. So you have hit it there again. Hideous I? toe, isn't it? You have hit it, like those two. 113, yeah, it's slower. Wow. All right, so can we have bombles, like as hard as you can hit, both ways? Yep. Fade, kill it. Oh, oh you are annoying the planet, but that is flying deeper into that water. Now, fast as you can, draw. This will be 124, 125. All right, big balls. Oh, there we go. Oh, yeah, you've flown the... F uh, oh, line ball. Get there. 121. Ooh. What was the last one? 121. Is that the same? Yeah, that's the same. Fast is fast. Let's have a look at your numbers then. Come on. What are you seeing then from your fades and your draws? Uh, club. Speed. 114, 113. Um, These are just two fades. Two fades. Um, and then we've got 118, 117. Two draws. Um, out to in, out to in, into out, into out, successful, closed, face to path with the draws, open with the fades, like all oh, what I'm going to be doing. Yeah. Um, angle attack, four down with my fade. Right. 3.8, 3.8, and 0.3 up, 0.5 up, so there's four degrees difference. On so I was one attack. degree at the most difference with my angle of attacks, yeah. where you're really brutalizing the two actions. So you are sided. Yeah. Um, but you're not sided. You, you've got room to learn how to fade it on the way up. Mm -hmm. You could argue. Yeah. And that's definitely something that I would think about when I'm on the golf course too. Mm. Like I have, I know that my angle tack goes down and when I'm trying to play my draw, I feel like I can hit up on it better and control it better. And you saw that on our last trip. Yeah. Didn't you? I was just going to a draw yeah. uh, as a stock shot. Yeah. Um, what about your two bombers then at the end? Uh, 120.7 for the fade, 121.4 with the draw, so marginally less quicker. than a year, mile an hour. Less than a mile an hour. Angle of attack on both? Uh, two down and 1.2 up. So they got closer? T tiny bit, yeah. Three, what's that? 3.2 difference. So not again a lot in that is yeah, there but yeah. i'm still down more up with the um draw see the bomber to me suggests that you have the potential to be hit whatever one you want mm. and get decent distance with both but you you say that but my spin with my cut ball yeah my spin loft on those two block bombers is going to be a lot higher and depending on the strike six three thousand six hundred nearly 3,700 with the fade and 2.6 mm. with the draw. That's a lot of difference in spin, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And that's... you can see the carry is completely different. 2.51 with the fade, 2.85 with the draw. It's 34 yards different. Like, that's quite, quite different. I would, and I would be playing draw and teach whoever came in and done this, you'd be, keep drawing it until yeah. you have to fade one. Yeah, yeah, totally. It reflects what we are as golfers, doesn't it? Like me as a more neutral golfer. Yeah. 
Um, and I would argue that I reckon I grew up doing a lot more experiment than you. Yes. Like the way I am as an adult, as a coach, that's why it led so well for me to become a coach, is that I used to do this as a kid. I, I wanted to know. Mm -hmm. um, and in those efforts, I think I've made myself quite neutral, which then allows me to move everything. Yeah. Where well, you are a forehand player. Yeah. And we're playing, I just keep getting on your backhand, I'm going to have an advantage. Yeah. Where I'm a little bit more of a two handed, almost both side tennis player, aren't I? Like, yeah. I don't matter which. There was, well, you talked once that there would be a, a tennis player with no backhand. Did you ever tell you that? No. So they would have two forehands. Oh, switch okay. Switch your hands. That yeah. was that uh, one well, I remember people were saying that's what they should, the ultimate tennis player would not have a backhand. You don't need one, do yeah, you? No, no. You're that way for that. Because I play tennis and I can flip, I can play. Double hand like on both sides if I want Ronnie to. Ronnie O'Sullivan in snooker, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, yeah, we don't have don't a have round a, the back one. He's basically not using a rest. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, but absolutely, with your students, you've got to know a little bit yeah. about how sided they are or yeah. what, haven't you? Otherwise, yeah. you will be banging your head against their brick wall and not helping them, yeah. actually hurting them. Put your comments down below. Do you find this interesting or not? Would you like to see more experiments like this? I love these kind of videos. Have they tested it? Have you tested it as well? Yeah. I bet, and, and that was just pure speed. I yeah. know my draw goes further through spin numbers, deliveries, and those kind of things. My draw isn't further than my fade. My speeds are exactly the same. Where for Matt, you definitely were the same at some point, yeah. but you were also very different when your personal delivery options were delivered, wouldn't they? Yeah, it's yeah. quite interesting. Post comments down below. What do you think? I'd love to hear how you tested. Remember, if you're not subscribed, give the little subscribe button a click, and then you won't miss any of the great tests that we've got coming soon. If you're already subscribed, bring that bell, don't they? Ring it. Get all those notifications. Beautiful.